Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Lucky Corners in uh, Workers and Resources in the, uh, well, I guess it's the uh, Republic with the Soviets, right? So last time around, as I recall, I've got this unfinished road thing up. Why do I have this unfinished road thing up? Oh, it's because of this thing, right? Okay. So I have this uh, twinned road operation coming online here. I also just built a uh, bigger water treatment plant, which I didn't actually need, but I figured, you know what, I'm going to build it. Yeah. And uh, this will allow me to get rid of all of this mess down here with pumps and, and everything, uh, because it's going to suck up the uh, water from here with a 85% quality. And it'll uh, suck it into here and turn it into 99% quality, right? And that should, well, it should get a long way to uh, solving future problems with water and get some stuff out of my way, right? Uh, in the meantime, what I've done is uh, plumbed it into the existing water pumps. And... Uh, I just need to uh, get chemicals in here, and it should start operating. Uh, it will also have drinking water once it starts operating. Uh, now, does it have... Uh, it does have a sewer connection. Okay. So, what I need is a truck. Yeah. Okay. So, it's going to be a covered hull. And uh, the, I'm going to go with a big one that can bring, you know, almost five tons of chemicals, right? Uh, why? Uh, because then I just need to run one truck back and forth, right? So I'm going to buy that. And I think I'm going to need to bump the... the um, are we producing... No, we're not producing chemicals because we don't have crops. Right, okay. So what I should do is go back up here and in the chemical pile, increase this to 20%. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so I'm going to do that. Uh, right, okay. Well, I need the uh, time to start rolling here, so we'll do that. And, well, uh, right, uh, where is the, the truck? Still, oh, it probably just came out of customs. Okay. So it'll come down here, it'll come in. <coughs> Excuse me. It'll come in here. It will uh, then leave and go and get gas. And then... Okay. Uh, let's just follow it while it gets gas. You know, just uh, for fun. But as soon as I turn this uh, uh, treatment plant uh, operational uh, with... Uh, with the fanciness uh, known as chemicals, right? It will uh, it will start uh, feeding water, and I can turn off the other one, uh, which is the general idea. Okay, good. Now uh, we need uh, chemical pile, chemical pile. And we need water treatment plant. So we're going to wait until unloaded with chemicals. And we're going to go here. We're going to. Are we going to wait until loaded? No. No, we're not. Because uh, we want to take chemicals as soon as we have them, right? So, uh, okay. Now we'll go in here and we'll go. <coughs> 
uh, rename this to Volun uh, <coughs> New Water Plant Chemicals. Yeah, okay. Save that. Launch it. Now, no. Now, watch it. Uh, so it's going to go down there. It's going to grab the chemicals. Uh, there should be enough for a full truckload. Right? No, oh, there's somewhere I probably need a priority set up. And over here, and we get 4.8 chemicals. Right. And off we go. It's not that far to the uh, Dewey here. And... Right. So we have... Yeah, it holds six tons so uh, we are producing we are producing water here okay uh, I'm gonna wait until the chemical supply maxes out now you don't go through the chemicals that fast with water treatment but uh, you know it does it does go through them and there we go. We have chemicals. We have water. We have... F um, you know what? This can actually handle not producing for parts of the day. Uh, if we go in here and we... Um, Okay, first of all, turn it off. Right, okay. So, that will just sit there. And we have, we are still supplying water. So, these guys are not empty okay that is good now uh, what is the plan I don't know what is the plan well you're the one that is running things so why don't you look up what the plan is what do you mean look up where are you gonna look it up oh well you know that's a good good question isn't it no, why don't you just make the plan? Yeah, that's probably smarter, isn't it? Right. So, uh, I guess if we look at the uh, pipe work here, I can take uh, I can take this out. These two pumps go away. Two long pi to a pipe down to here, and a pipe down to here. Okay. Okay, well, that is going to be a problem for another day, or another minute. Uh, no, what I'm going to do, <clears throat> I'm going to go up here and just uh, observe the how the production's going here. And the bridge part is just about done, and then it's down to paving, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's just about done. So, um, wow, got there and then went back for gas, really? Uh, right. Yeah, down to paving that. Okay, good. Now what? Well, you probably, where are you, 
okay we're dropping the sewage over over here so we're not going to be creating a sewage problem for uh pollution here but we might have a pollution problem let's uh um uh city planning overlays no No, no, no. Go and grab... Where's the name of the area? Where is the name of the area? Okay. So here... Good. Uh, what's the range? Uh, okay, range comes out to here, yeah, and down to there, so these guys are in a different city, they're in this one, uh, yeah, they are, and, okay, so I need a couple of pollution monitors, I think. Just to uh, know what's going on. Okay, so that's going to be state infrastructure, right? Pollution monitoring station. I could put a pollution monitoring station right here. Yeah, so I'll put one right there. And, and see, they don't cost much. So uh, I just want to know what the pollution levels are. Okay, I can close that. Uh, I also want to jo just go check on the population. I want to check on lifespan. Yeah, so these are lower and these are lower. So that's got to be from all of this business up here, right? So uh, I need to get more workers living where it's cleaner, uh, which is down here, right? So, uh, I, I suspect I'm going to find that uh, pollution levels are questionable here. And that's probably why this is taking the time it is to go up, right? Uh, yeah. As all this stuff is really close here, right? Uh, so, th there isn't any good mitigation for that either, I don't think. So... Uh, the real question is, uh, what do I do with these uh, uh, these guys here? Because I got a lot of population up there, and yeah. Uh, so I've got a concrete plant. Well, those don't create a lot of uh, pollution when they're not operating, do they? I don't think they do. That's a question. I, I don't know. Uh, anyone who feels like answering, uh, do uh, industrial uh, buildings uh, create pollution when they're not operating? This one definitely does. So I need to move this. Okay, I think that's a plan. Uh, that's definitely a plan. Okay, so I want to move this uh, out of there, uh, but I also want an oil tank. So, yeah. So I guess that's the... Oh, uh, I want to make sure I don't run out of rubles too. How's this doing? Yeah, losing money. Well, I'm going to borrow money in small chunks as needed. So, I think it's probably worth doing it now. Uh, you know, if I can keep it down around less than 50% of the maximum loan and just keep it as a stable situation, then I'll be, I should be fine. 
Now, what I want here is uh, liquids. I want a, I'm going to put a big storage tank in. Um, uh, put it in this way. Yeah, put it in this way. Yep. Okay. I'm going to start out with a storage tank here. And get that built. Uh, put a big one in. And then the oil field will fill it up. Uh, oh, also, underground pipe. Underground pipe. Uh... Wrong kind of, uh, that's the wrong kind of pump. Okay. No, because I want to take it out of here and then into here. Okay, so I need that built first. Right. Well, that's fine. So I should have built this right from the start, but I didn't. Right? So, there is that. Meanwhile, the metro tracks are slowly getting built up to here. And this is done. Okay. So I can go and make it a uh, divided uh, freeway thing up to here uh, and up to here and up to here. One way there, one way there, one way there, one way there. Okay. So we'll do this. Yeah. Down this way. Yeah. There we go. The, uh, the highway out to there is completed. I do... is Can I make it a higher speed? I can go up to 90. Okay. And this is max speed 110. Okay. Okay, the max speed on any road is 110, so yay. Well, uh, that will get these guys uh, not moving any faster, really, but I just think it looks cooler, right? Okay, now what do I want to do? I want to get these little bits, these crossover points, paved. Do I want... To keep, yeah, I'm going to keep the crossover point there. Okay. Pave that. Pave that. Okay. Right. Oh, we have crops. Okay, good. Uh, we now have crops that are going to uh, get taken down to the chemical plant. Um, all related chemical plant crop supply. Yeah, there we go. That's going to the custom house. Yeah. So, do we have down here a chemical plant? Uh, we have crops coming. Uh, related vehicles. No, it's coming to here. Uh, this guy. Okay. Where are you? 
You're going up the road. Yay. And up the gravel. Really? Uh, what's your... Oh, because your speed is 60. Okay. I should replace some of these vehicles with faster vehicles at some point. Yeah, but that costs money. You don't have enough. Ah, yes, I see. I see the problem. Uh, right. You were checking in on the population business. Okay, this year. Uh, up, 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 slight down, up, up, up. Okay, well, we're not doing too bad on the population business. We have harvested the uh, business with the... Uh, Uh, the uh, fields there, uh, mostly, some of them. Uh, right, so we are going to the custom house. No, we're going to keep 10% in the silo, I think. No, 20%. Why? So that, uh, well, with 20% in the silo, we have something to fu fuel our chemical plant. Yeah, I mean, that's really clever, isn't it? Traffic jam. Where's the traffic jam? Wee down here. Okay. I wish you could mark an area. Don't show traffic jams, you know. Uh, right. Now, chemical plant doesn't have the crops in yet. But the truck should be on its way. Uh, so if we crop supply... Uh, close that. Close that. Yeah. View it. Yay! It's a truck. You are certain that's a truck? Well, it might be a lorry. You're not British. Oh. Well, then it's a truck. I see. Right, okay, and in we go. We are bringing the crops, and now we have crops there that can slowly produce chemicals. So there is that. I do need a great deal more uh, chemical production, and that's going to be uh, an important thing here uh, in the future. So I'm going to have to build a whole new... Uh, production area for that but in the meantime let's get let's start working on moving the oil refinery here over this way so it's further from the uh the houses i think that will help because uh the pollution coming out of this can't be good right uh this number is doing okay I think it's partly because people living down here aren't having po pollution issues. Oh yeah, I moved some people down there, didn't I? Right. And now it's 79% happiness, 97% health, and lifespan, 84 years. I mean, that seems uh, reasonable, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, it does. So... Uh, I guess the uh, the obvious uh, thing... Oh, I'm, I'm putting on a sweater because of a draft. Uh, uh, you know, I guess uh, it's, uh, it's not so bad down here. So I'm going to be putting more uh, people living down here, uh, ultimately. But... Uh, and I might take some of these out, ultimately. But I, I'm just... Uh, you know, I'm slowly working on adjusting things, right? Uh, something I also need is uh, water treatment for sewage, it's, uh, wastewater treatment. And yeah, I wonder if uh, the game will give good enough treatment possibility to take the output from the wastewater treatment and feed it into a regular water treatment plant. Uh, without uh, 
you know, uh, be sort of self-sufficient on that. Well, that would be something. I'll have to try it in my private offline game. Uh, right. Okay. So that's doing fine. That's doing fine. That's doing fine. That's doing fine. That doesn't have... We don't have a... We have 1% here. Unemployed workers due to no work... Okay. Uh, we're starting to come up with uh, unemployed workers. Over 4,700 people. I think if, if, if I recall correctly, this did get over 5,000 at one point. Uh, and then a whole bunch of uh, die-offs happened, right? Now this... Uh, yeah. Well, that's not doing too bad. Uh, right, because it's on a mechanism. Yeah. Okay. And then, yeah, okay. Uh, and I can afford to stop this for a while. Yeah, I can actually. I can afford to actually stop this. That's 50 workers. What if I just stop this? Yeah. Uh, that should reduce pollution, right? And then I'm going to want to put a... I think I'm going to want to put it over this way a bit and then bus workers in, right? Yeah, probably. Okay, so that's going to be fossil fuels, right? And it's going to be oil refinery. And if I put the full-on oil refinery up here, um, yeah, actually, I could put the full-on oil refinery up here. Yeah, I could. Yeah, if I put it up here, it's much further away from the workers. Yeah. I'm going to put the big oil refinery up there. And then I come up here and bring... Oh, you put that in the wrong place, you idiot. Yeah. Okay, try that again, but better. Oil refinery. Okay, put it here. No, put it here. Bam. Yes, okay. We can put it there. Oh, I don't want that pipe. No, I'm going to put a forwarding pump in there. Now, uh, first of all, though, I'm going to build the refinery, uh, which is going to require connecting it to a road. Bam. Okay, and yeah. Okay, are you actually building the road? Yeah, you are. Okay, now this, that's going to need workers now. Uh, allow it to have workers. Okay, now this, we've got a fair amount of storage on both of these, so this can stay off for a while, right? Now, I'm going to... Just uh, call up the overlay for uh, life uh, expectancy. Right. Yeah, see? The numbers went up. Uh, yeah. Uh, they're relatively low here, so I'm going to end up removing the uh, residences here and maybe put other stuff there. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, those went up as soon as I turned that off. That's actually fine. Now, here, we're waiting for steel. Oh, there's the steel coming. Yeah, so I'm going to change the piping to come from here into here. And then 
here, one of them will come into there. Um, which means this is going to have a period where it doesn't have anything. So I may need to import some electricity in the interim. The building's on fire. Let's go take a look at the fire. Uh, we have uh, fire trucks on the way. There they are. And fire extinguished. Yes. Yay. Okay, back over here. Let's just observe this. This is going to build up pretty quick because the crane is there. And then I'll pause it while I adjust the pipes just to give less time while the power is running uh, and using up the oil, right? And poof. Okay, so we're going to store oil here. Okay, good. Uh, pipes, yes. Uh, get rid of, no. No, that's dry bulk. Liquids. Empty, get rid of pipe. Take that pipe out. Yeah. And we're going to go for an underground pipe there and an underground pipe there yes and then we feed into the existing pipeline oh I can just put a pipe like that straight out of that one the existing pump might as well do that yeah okay so we'll queue those up. This one and this one are the critical ones. So I'll build those first. And go. Now let's see how fast this goes down. It'll take a while for all of the stuff in line in the pumps. Uh, oh, it'll take a while for it to erode this because it's over. Right? And okay. Wait, we've got exports of oil going. Hmm. Yeah, I should probably uh, uh, just uh, not do that. Actually, no, I'm going to leave it alone uh, just to see uh, how quick the uh, pipelines go up. Uh, they shouldn't take long uh, being... Uh, assigned. So let's uh, let's take a look here. And we have Yeah, they'll they'll go up pretty quick and then the uh, the pipeline uh, sequence will uh, resume. And these guys are going to survive a, a fair long time before they get empty so that's why you want to have storages all over right uh, you want the buffers and I didn't build the buffer and that was dumb right so uh, so was I doing it wrong not really but not the smart way either there's a lack of buffer thing it's quite common in real life too right <laughs> Uh, right. Okay. So it's, uh, well, those, those pipes are short, so they should go up pretty quick. Uh, they're relatively inexpensive as well. You know, they take steel. Steel is expensive to import. I really need to get to building, making my own steel, building steel. Um, but it's also 
uh, something that we can manage because we don't need it, uh, at least uh, for uh, general uh, operations, right? It's only when we're building stuff that we really need it. Now, I expect that will change in a future version where they're, we're building maintenance is going to be a thing. Uh, yeah, that uh, that is apparently coming. And that's going to change the equation a little bit, I'm sure. Uh, every new update will change the equation. And uh, yeah, and, and I'll probably just turn that stuff on, right? Uh, I am looking forward to the uh, demolition uh, operations, so that's going to change the game because you're going to have to be a little more careful on where you build things because you'll have to have a demolition office to take it apart. On the other hand, you'll get some of the resources back when you do. So uh, that, uh, you know, it's, it's that one's a fair trade, I think. Uh, right. We just need the steel to arrive here. Um, let's just go up here and uh, observe this. It's down to almost half. But there's 200 in the power plant. And I'm worried about the power plant, not the other stuff. Right. Uh, yeah. So. Okay, we've got. We're waiting for steel. Oh, there's some steel. Which. Uh, okay, that'll get one. Okay, I'm going to open this. And then we can observe. This will start filling up really quickly as it empties out the pump jacks, right? Yeah. And then when the pump jacks are emptied, it'll slow down uh, to the actual production rate. Yeah. Uh, and then it will empty out really quick when the other uh, pipe is completed and it'll it refills the oil storage up there. Yeah. At least I had the oil storage up there to buffer the uh, power plant uh, yeah that uh, although we haven't even used up uh, 200 uh, oil on the power plant so uh, that's uh, I mean because some of that's been exported right so uh, yeah so we need the mechanical components to arrive and then that's them. Then we need the workers and a crane. I don't think the crane's too far away. Yeah, the, there's the crane coming. And then workers. Uh, we do have workers because we turned off the, uh, the plant, right? Uh, yeah. You know what? Uh, I should take this out and let it use up the uh, the oil there. Yeah, I'll let this pipe get uh, get completed, and then we'll uh, we'll do that. And it's just about done. And this will just this will go down uh, by a couple hundred, and then yep. So the uh, buffer up there is filling up again. Yep. Okay. Good. Uh, the oil now has a buffer tank, and now I can go ahead and, no, I don't think I should do that. I should get this. Now, this needs 300 tons of steel. Um, yeah, I should get that building, and I'm going to build it with the first steps without uh, workers. Uh, that's going to take a lot of concrete, a lot of gravel, and a lot of asphalt, right? So, meanwhile, I'll just let these things uh, tick along up here. Uh, yeah, okay. Now, uh, yeah, so this up here, I'm pretty sure, is far enough away. Now, uh, from here... Uh, this is 161 up to there. Oh. Oh. I can get workers into there. Uh, just by... Oh. If I drop this underground... Oh. 
Yeah, so if I was to drop this underground, I could get a path across here. And workers will be in this will be in workers will be in range of the helicopter spot here. Yeah. Okay, now here deciding where they think is best. Where they think is best, where they think is best, where they think is best. I don't have anybody specifically attached to the thing there. No, I don't. Okay, good. Yeah, once I take the pipe out up to here, I'll let it use up the oil and... Uh, and then, uh, yeah, it should be good. Now, we should have plenty of time to drop this and build it without this uh, emptying. Uh, yeah. Okay. Now, this is still going up, but you can see all of the pump jacks are operating. Right? Right? And that's because we're taking the full capacity of the oil field and we're filling the storage, right? And it, it's going up. That's good. Now this just needs gravel. Okay. And the next stage will need actual uh, people. Uh, oh. Okay. Drop that. Okay. Okay, just needs a little bit more gravel, and in the gravel storage, yeah, we have plenty of gravel, so we're good. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to put the cut here, and then I'm going to uh, start working on adjusting this pipeline to be fully underground, like the last two uh, legs of it, and uh, that will open up the space here to uh, do other things. I'm going to leave the road where it is. Now, I built this road to service the pipeline. But it's going to stay there. And uh, nobody's going to know why there's this weird angle road in this grid area here. Uh, they'll understand why the roads are weird over here with the oil field. But you know what I mean, right? Organic development. I know, right? Uh, okay, so that... Oh, well, that's going going pretty quick with eight excavators. Yeah. Okay, well, anyway, uh, this is going to be the cut point. So, uh, yeah, uh, I do have a Patreon, uh, incidentally, if you feel like you want to support the channel. If you don't feel like you want to support the channel, well, then don't. Uh, the link will be in the description either way. So, you know, it's a thing. Uh, link's in the description. Uh, anyway... Uh, that's going to be all for this time, so see you back next time.